Well, good morning. We're in the car first thing in the morning. It is currently a 4.57 a.m. And today is a special day. Today is the first time that I'm going to be doing intense activity post-op cosmetic surgery. And what we're doing today, I'm actually really excited about. You, you saw that I brought my coffee with me. I am actually about three quarters of the way through it. I'm trying to drink it before we get to our destination. You also, I also brought a water with me post destination. So you're probably wondering, where the heck are you going at 4.57 a.m.? We are going to Tucson to hike to Mamak Mountain to Mamak Hill. Now I've hiked this hill in the past twice, actually once with my boot camp group and then once by myself. And I haven't done it in so long and I have been just craving this hike. It is such a fantastic hike. It is absolutely beautiful. Now, originally I was thinking that I would like to go to see the sun come up, but the sun comes up pretty early. I mean, it's not even 5 a.m. and it's been white-ish outside now for about 20 minutes. So I would have had to get up at like 3.30 in the morning to make it to the sunrise and that just wasn't gonna happen. But we should still get some really beautiful views this morning and I'm really anxious to see how my body does doing this hike post cosmetic surgery. I haven't done any intense exercise at all and this is a pretty intense hike. I mean, it is a lot of switchbacks straight up the side of a mountain and I am so excited. Uh, it is about a 25 minute drive from my house so we are just about there. Of course, I'm gonna take you guys along with me. We're gonna get our activity in this morning. We have a busy day ahead of us today. I did bring a healthy eating all the time and go peanut butter protein bar with me. I thought if I was hungry after the hike, I would at least have something with me to eat. And then I think also we'll stop and get another coffee, just like a post hike coffee to give us that little extra bit of energy to make it through the rest of our day. But I am so excited for this. I hardly slept last night because I'm that excited about it. So I'm going to go ahead and finish up my coffee. Let's hike to Mama Hill. 8 a.m. and we just arrived at Tumamak Hill. I can't tell you how excited I am and look how beautiful it is out. It's actually almost 80 degrees already at 5 a.m. So it's a good thing that we decided to come bright and early because we actually have an excessive heat warning right now. We're about 111 or higher during the day. So I'm glad that I came when it was 80 and it feels actually really, really nice outside. And literally, I'm just so excited to be here. That fate is patient. Go run away, get it out of your system. Come back when you're older. Go find a place where you can't be the victim. And come back when you're older. Go catch the Whew. I'm already out of breath. <laughs> Which, by the way, I'm climbing straight up the side of this mountain, but holy moly. It's so beautiful out. There's a little wind, which I very much appreciate. I'm officially about half way, maybe a little over halfway. We're getting to the super straight up hill switchbacks, which is the, the hardest part. I'm feeling really good though. I mean, I'm out of breath to be expected, but I'm feeling amazing. I'm about to start the final switchback, which is the longest and steepest. Summer's end, and you feel that this is your beginning. Well, colors fade, but it's okay. There is good in
What a fantastic hike this morning. I mean, this is everything that my soul needed. My body needed it, my soul needed it. It's warm, but there is that breeze, which is lovely. The view is worth every huff and puff up this huge switchback right here. There's actually several of these switchbacks. I would say that I'm about halfway down, just about halfway down the mountain. And I'm so happy I did this, like so incredibly happy. Girl needs some water. Oh my gosh, you guys. That was so good. So good. Let me turn my watch off and I'll tell you. So I have 64 active minutes. I walked three and a half miles. I'll put up here on the screen what my average heart rate was because I actually have to look at that on my phone, which I'm filming on right now for you guys. But that was everything I needed it. Like I said, that was everything that I wanted it to be. It is officially 619 in the morning and I am done working out for the day. I mean, what could be better than that? I'm going to go ahead and sip on my water, eat my healthy eating all the time and go bar on the way home. That's going to be my breakfast. So now I'm going to go get a coffee. I feel like I need another coffee, even though I just drank one like an hour and a half ago. My favorite place in Tucson to go besides Dutch Brothers, which is actually by where I live, so I can really go to Dutch Brothers anytime, is this coffee shop called Black Rock Coffee. I don't know if it's local to Tucson, but I absolutely love it. And I know that there's not one too far from here. So let's go get coffee number two of the day. Can I have a iced Americano with the sugar-free caramel blondie? Here you go, thank you. Yeah, you too. Like I said, this is one of my favorite coffee places. Whenever I come to Tucson and I'm near one, I always go here. I'll even save up getting coffee so that I can come to Black Rock. I love it. It's a little bit pricey. I would say really similar to like Dutch Brothers prices, maybe even a little bit more. I wanna say this was about $5.40 and then I tipped her so it was like $6.40. Mm, God, that's so good. So the caramel blondie is sugar-free caramel sauce, sugar-free white chocolate sauce, and then I got just the splash of cream. I kind of had to guesstimate points and calories because I can't find the nutrition information for the Americano. I can find it for the latte, but I can't find it for the Americano. So I'll go ahead and put the points, calories, guesstimation here on the screen. So I am ready for the day. I ended up only eating half of my healthy eating bar just because the coffee kind of filled me up, but I am ready for a morning snack. My stomach is starting to growl. So I am going to make a yogurt bowl. You guys know how much I love my yogurt bowl. I eat it pretty much every single day. And I'm gonna put a little bit of a twist on it today because I just got this beauty in the mail and I am dying to try it out. This is from the brand Earth Echo and this is the Cacao Bliss Superfood Elixir Blend. So cacao powder is like a chocolate vibe, a chocolate powder. This is ceremonial grade cacao blended with turmeric, MCT, Lacuma and four superfoods. Supports mental focus, boosts your energy, and reduces cravings. There's 30 safe servings. This is organic, gluten-free, non-dairy, soy-free, and non-GMO. I'm really excited to try this out just to give myself a little boost of superfoods, especially after taking that hike this morning. This is just a good way to add chocolate flavor with all of those superfood benefits. This says it's a raw cacao, turmeric, MCT oil, lucuma, and four additional superfoods. Ooh, organic cinnamon, Himalayan salt, mesquite, and black pepper fruit are powerful superfood ingredients that support overall wellness. You guys know I'm very into wellness supplements and supplements in general, and I cannot wait to try this out. I will link this down below, the Earth Echo website and the Cacao Bliss with a discount for you guys if you're interested. But I'm going to add some of that to my yogurt bowl. I always start the base with the Chobani Zero Sugar. Today I'm going to do mixed berry to have that berry chocolate. And then I'm going to add some fresh strawberries, 
some granola per usual. Today I'm going to use the favorite day from Target. This is the strawberry whip topping. This is so good. And then I put a huge scoop of Chia Smash. This is my favorite thing in the whole world. Speaking of Chia Smash, I actually found this on Amazon for even cheaper than the Chia Smash website. So I actually ordered all of the flavors. I think it was a six pack. I'll link the Amazon batch, the Amazon bundle down below for you. Like I said, it was cheaper than buying it on the Chia Smash website. If you do subscribe to Imperfect Foods or you want to, I'll link Imperfect Foods too with I think $20 of free groceries. You can buy these for about $6.99, $5.99 to $6.99 per jar, which is comparable to the Amazon price, cheaper than like Sprouts and health food stores. But I love Chia Smash. This is literally just raspberries, chia seeds, dates, and lemons. So between my Earth Echo Cacao Bliss and my Chia Smash, I'm getting in all the healthy superfoods. Look at how amazing this looks. I mix the Earth Echo Cacao Bliss in with my yogurt before I topped it with my strawberries, my granola, a little bit of that strawberry whipped cream and some Chia Smash. So let's taste test this, see what we think of this Cacao Bliss. I'll tell you, it smells amazing. All right, let's test this out. I'm gonna get a little bit of everything here. Mm. It tastes like a decadent dessert. This adds some excellent flavor. It's cocoa-y, and then you get that vanilla and that cinnamon. It is so good. It definitely elevates my yogurt bowl. I will be using this a lot for the added superfoods, the added benefits, the energy, the MCTs. It's so good. It is literally like a dessert, packed with protein, packed with superfoods. I can't recommend this enough. I can't wait to put this in smoothies, protein shakes, that's going to become quite a staple. So I actually just mixed up my Motivate No Stim for the day and it reminded me to let you guys know about an amazing bundle deal that Motivate has going on right now on their website. I actually just placed an order and saw this bundle deal on there and said note to self, tell everybody about it because this is an amazing, amazing deal. So the bundle I wanted to share with you guys is actually the ultimate weight loss bundle. It includes three products that really are staples from the Motivate line. First is Motivate Detox. They just recently repackaged their detox. It is so beautiful. I love the black and gold sleek packaging. They also repackaged their burn capsules in this new black as well. I really, really love this. This is about my third bottle of detox. This is something that I take daily. What I love about detox is number one, it helps you beat the bloat. Now I suffer from inflammation. I do get bloated pretty regularly and this definitely helps. It also offers a full body cleanse and helps with digestion. With all of that, it also helps lead to weight loss. So it's definitely a great supplement to incorporate. Again, it's something that I take daily. You do receive a full bottle of detox in the bundle. This is typically $44.99. Now, one product that I don't have on hand is Motivate Sleep. This is another really great product. If you struggle going to sleep, Motivate Sleep is part of this weight loss bundle as well. It helps support a healthy metabolism, a deep sleep, and weight loss. A natural sleep supplement that not only helps you fall asleep, but stay asleep. And it is a fantastic product. It's something that I I've used in the past and Troy, my husband, uses it every single night. We've noticed big differences in his sleep quality. All you do is take about two, you take two capsules about 20 to 30 minutes before you go to sleep and you sleep like a baby. So again, a fantastic product. You do get a full bottle of Motivate Sleep. This is also a $44.99 value. And then last but not least, my baby, the product that started my love for Motivate and that is Motivate burn. Now I have so many of the flavors. I love them all. This particular one is cherry lemonade. There is motivate burn and no stim burn. So if you're sensitive to caffeine, the no stim burn is perfect for you. It comes in Miami lemonade and kiwi strawberry, both of which I love. The motivate burn with stimulant with caffeine comes in multiple flavors. Every single one is absolutely incredible. This is a great way to give you focus energy, fat loss, help with weight loss, and just keep you motivated and going throughout the day. This is a product that I use almost every day, whether it's the regular Motivate Burn or the No Stim. And in this bundle deal, you get to choose whether you want the Caffeine Motivate or the No Stim Motivate. Motivate Burn on its own also retails for $44.99. Now, this bundle deal, wait until you hear what a killer price this is. Normally, this bundle would be $124.99. It's currently on sale 
sale on the Motivate website for $99. And if you use my link, my code, you can actually get the entire bundle for $80. That's less than the price of two of the three products in the bundle. And these are great items for Motivate. The Burn is what started my love affair with the brand. They are such fantastic supplement. So I will link Motivate down below for you with the discount so that you can pick up the bundle for only $80. And this discount is good site-wide. So you can do shopping on the Motivate site and pick up all of your other favorite items. So I'm ready for some lunch. I am going to make myself half of a sandwich using the Dave's Killer Bread Thin Sliced. I really like this bread. Half of a sandwich is good enough for me because I'm going to have a few things with my sandwich. I am going to use, I think the roasted turkey, the oven roasted turkey out of this pack of lunch meat, a slice of Sargento ultra thin cheese, light mayo, and then I'm going to have a side of cherries and a side of cucumbers. I may put a little bit of ranch with my cucumbers, and then I may have something sweet after. We'll see how if I'm still a little bit hungry, but let me go ahead and make up my lunch, and then I'll show you the completed meal. Here is my lunch for today. I put it on my Uba home plate. You guys know I love my pre-portioned plates. So I have my cucumbers with a tablespoon of light ranch, some cherries, my half of a sandwich with turkey and mayo, the light mayo, and the thin cheese. And then I did decide to go ahead and add on one of the Trader Joe's peanut little chocolate bars. These are so good, well worth 100 calories and four points. So that is my lunch. I'll go ahead and put points macros here on the screen for you. Do you need something after my lunch? Yeah, I think you do. Do you guys want your special bones? Oh, special bone. So for an afternoon snack, I'm going to make a protein shake. That'll be my second protein supplement of the day. If you didn't know, I have two supplements every single day. It just helps me get in my protein. We're gonna make this simple. So I'm going to use Clean Simple Eats Chocolate Brownie Batter Protein. This is really good. It's just a chocolate, really decadent chocolate protein powder that you can put anything into it to kind of zhuzh it up if you want to. I think what I'm going to do is top it with some of my Girl Scout Cookie Thin Mint topping from Sam's Club and some whipped cream. I'll show you that, but I am going to use Clean Simple Eats Chocolate Brownie Batter Protein. I will link Clean Simple Eats down below for you with the discount. You already know, it's my all-time favorite protein powder. And then I'm simply going to mix that with my Fairlife chocolate milk. I throw a couple ice cubes in, blend it up, and it is the most decadent protein shake that seriously gives milkshake vibes. So here is my protein shake. So I topped it with some whipped cream, and then this goodness on top is this Girl Scout cookie topper that I got at Sam's Club. It's just going to add that little bit of chocolate mint. This protein shake has over 30 grams of protein and it literally tastes like a milkshake. I'm really excited for tonight's dinner. We're doing a low carb stuffed zucchini boat. I can't wait for this, so let me show you what you'll need. First, you're going to need zucchini, four, five, six, however many boats you want to make. You'll need Parmesan cheese and then some type of white cheese. I went ahead and chose Monterey Jack. 99% extra lean ground turkey, tomato paste, an onion, crushed red pepper flakes, parsley, either dried or fresh, salt and pepper. I will link my acacia wood salt and pepper holder down below. I bought it off of Amazon. It's $10 or less. Really, really nice quality. Minced garlic, a can of petite diced tomatoes, and some oil. So the first thing I'm going to do is actually trim both the ends off of the zucchini. I have a big stock pot full of water and salt coming to a boil for the zucchini. And then I just added my 99% ground turkey to a skillet and we're going to allow it to brown. So I have my zucchini in, we're in the stock pot. We're going to allow it to boil for about five minutes. I did go ahead and add about a tablespoon of oil to my ground turkey, dice up my yellow onion, and now we're going to let this cook down completely. My zucchini is still boiling away. I'm going to add in my can of petite diced tomatoes, about a quarter cup of tomato paste, a big heaping scoop of minced garlic, shred pepper flakes, and then a little salt and pepper. 
And then we're going to mix this together and just allow it to cook down until a lot of that liquid is gone. We are going to be adding some zucchini to this as well. So I'm going to reduce the heat just to low, just to keep it nice and warm until our zucchini is done. So once your zucchini are done, we're actually going to go ahead and cut them in half and then we're going to scoop out the inside so basically the seated area and that's going to create our boat Remember when you told me you believe in something and you said you're done pretending so I took the inside of one of the zucchinis, chopped it up, and we're going to add it to our meat mixture. I have my oven preheating to 350 degrees. I'm going to pull out a baking dish and let's put together these zucchini boats. To the meat mixture, I'm adding half of a cup of Parmesan cheese, a little bit of parsley. We're going to stir that in. I did add all of my boats to a sprayed nine by 13 baking dish and we're going to fill it with this yummy cheesy mixture. And we're just going to divide the mixture evenly in the boats. Now we're going to add about a cup of cheese right on top of the zucchini. I didn't quite have enough Monterey Jack cheese, so I added a little bit of shredded cheddar. And then we're going to sprinkle some more parsley on top. Pop this into our 350 degree oven for about 25 to 30 minutes or until it's cooked through. So here are the zucchini boats. They look amazing. I have some microwavable rice going for a side dish. I will go ahead and plate this up. Be back to share points, calories, and macros. So here is my dinner. I did one of the zucchini boats. It made quite a few. You can actually have two per serving. I probably will have a second one, but I plated up one zucchini boat, just a tiny bit of rice, a quarter cup of the Uncle Ben's microwavable broccoli cheddar rice. Troy's plate, there's a big difference between the two. So dessert tonight, we're gonna keep it pretty simple. I'm going to have I'm going to have a bag of the Lesser Evil Sugar Cookie Popcorn. I actually forgot I had these, and so I've been trying to eat these up. Really good, 70 calories for the bag. And then I'm actually going to have one of these. These are new into my life. I actually shared these in my Facebook group and on my Instagram. These are from Chalk Zero. They're the Sea Salt Caramels. You guys, these are so good. They're caramel, they're salt, they're delicious. You can have three of them for 100 calories. You can see that they are a pretty good size. So I'm just going to have one of these along with my popcorn for dessert. Thank you for joining me for today's What I Eat in a Day on WW. I hope you enjoyed coming along with me today. We had a huge NSV taking that massive hike up the mountain. Amazing food today. Don't forget about the Motivate Bundle deal well, as the cacao powder. All of the info, all of that will be linked down below for you, as well as all of the other things that I shared with you in today's video, nutrition coaching, links and discounts to my other favorite things. And don't forget, come join our Facebook group, we would love to have you. Thank you so much for watching. Oh, one other thing. Tonight's dinner recipe is on my recipe website. I'll put that down below for you as well. Now, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.